chairman of study group, actually I'm in charge of two broad uh, tasks. The first one is try to lay down the managerial structure for the study group itself in terms of the selection and the appointment of rapporteurs and vice rapporteurs for different questions and also for identifying the tasks that will be assigned to rapporteurs' questions as well as the vice chair's tasks to ensure a smooth and cooperative way of operation. The second is to progressively taking care of the following up of the questions and combating any challenges when it arises so that we can finally reach the outcomes that's expected by all nations. Study Group 2 is addressing the topic of digital transformation. And this one is right now the focus of every nation and it becomes necessity right now. It's not an option anymore. So ICT-based services have been widely spread and adopted by different nations in different disciplines. Simply throughout this study period, we are going to answer main three questions. How to be able to provide and ensure digital services and build digital societies? And second, how to ensure and enable the required environment in terms of security and digital skills required? And third, how can we utilize ICT to better preserve the environment and mitigate any health hazards which might arise? Actually, I'm pretty confident that this cycle would be exceptional and would be different, evidenced by different things. First, we have many number of nominations for the management positions. Second, we have many newcomers, which reflects a lot of interest from different member states. And third, we have a diversity of participants right now. We have a lot coming from academia, also I'm right now hearing the voices of the youth as well. So I would hope that we can reach a fruitful outcome that would be like a suit of different outcomes in terms of reports, in terms of workshops, in terms of guidelines, in terms of uh, collaborative platforms that will enable the decision makers, especially for the developing countries, to be able to build digital societies and digital economies, as well as I hope that we could achieve an open dialogue involving different stakeholders related to digital transformation. And in particular, we should achieve good collaboration between ITU and the other UN agencies to be able to connect the different gears so that we can really move to the right direction at the right speed. We are talking about a digital society, so we are building a society f which is different for the future. So youth right now are those who are, will be in the future itself, so we should hear their voices at the moment. Actually, they are coming with different fresh opinions, considerations that we should really consider while developing our work plans. And for example, yesterday I asked them explicitly to talk in one of the questions and to express their thoughts so that we can really take into account and I would encourage them to come even for the other meetings to express more of their voices. <music>